Drop a like on this video in the next 5 seconds if you guys want to get the Season 4 Battle Pass for free. What's going on friends and welcome back to a brand new Fortnite's Battle Royale video here on the channel. In today's video we have some brand new information on the upcoming Season 4 Battle Pass skins and some of the exclusive bundles that are going to be released during Season 4 as well, which were actually confirmed by Epic Games. They are amazing, and today we're going to be looking at all of these different skins and how you guys are going to be able to get them for yourself. So make sure to stick around to the very end. You're definitely not going to want to miss this one. And yes, today's video will not have face cam, unfortunately. I just moved back to my new setup, and I do not have my camera all ready to go. But by tomorrow, I should have the face cam and everything will be back to normal, so I apologize for that. Before we dive into the rest of the video, we gotta go ahead and send our daily gift to a lucky subscriber. And this item shop is one of the most stacked item shops we have seen in so long in Fortnite. We have a brand new skin, the Splatterella, which I think looks amazing. We also have the Batman Crusader pack coming back into the item shop, and we also have all of the DC collaboration skins. So we have the Batman skin, the Harley Quinn skin. There is so much to gift today. I think I'm going to go ahead and send someone the brand new Splatterella skin, and I'm also going to send someone the Harley Quinn skin, because I know a lot of you guys really want that. So let's go ahead and hook someone up with this real quick. This gift is going to Aliens Will Die, so shout out to you for supporting the channel. I really appreciate it, my man. So send in the gift. There you go. I hope you enjoy. I really do like this skin, actually. And now that he got his gift, let's go ahead and also send the Harley Quinn skin as well. Oh, I totally forgot. They come with, uh, they come with, like, style challenges. That's cool. The second gift of today's video is going to Agent Peely Peel, so shout out to you for supporting the channel. And if you guys want to be like these people and receive a gift in a future video, all you have to do is drop a like, make sure you are subscribed to the channel when notifications turned on, and also leave your epic usernames down in the comment section below so I can add you and send you the gift. And since we do have an amazing item shop, if you guys are going to be buying the brand new skin or any of the Marvel Times DC collaboration skins, make sure to use support to creator code NERPA. You guys have been showing so much love and support with the code, so I appreciate it. And it's thanks to you guys that I'm able to do all the giveaways and gifting here on the channel. So thank you so much to everyone that is using my code in the item shop. All right, my boy, they want to go Lazy Lake. Honestly, I'm completely fine with that. We never land lazy. So let's give it a shot. These last few videos, we've been getting absolutely destroyed. So maybe landing somewhere different will help us finally get a win today because we've been choking a lot. And like I said in the beginning of the video, today we are going to be focusing on Season 4. And more specifically, we're going to be looking at some of the Battle Pass skins, the secret skin that we're going to get, and also some brand new bundles that are going to be coming out into the game as well that I think are going to be playing a part in the storyline that Fortnite has planned for us in Season 4, which is very exciting. Oh my gosh, we just hit him for 144. Get out of my lobby, brother. Get out of my lobby. We're going to be sneaky. I literally missed. He doesn't even have a gun. Why do so many people land out here and not even get weapons? Like, what was this guy doing? I think that was a bot. Get the heck away from my house, dude. This guy was trying to break in. Trying to break into my house without me knowing. Oh, no. I just realized both of my teammates died. Come on. Come on. All right, well, I got, their, I got their cards, which is good. Oh, my gosh. That guy almost hit me with his shotgun. Bro, we're melting these guys. Oh, here's the squad right here. Okay. Bro, I don't know what... I don't know what's going on. This guy is so weak, though. Okay, there's one down. Oh, my God. I actually don't know what's going on right now. Oh, there he is. Let's go. That was the final guy here, too. All right, so diving right into the topic of today's video, which, of course, is the Season 4 skins. If you guys have been watching the videos here, you would know a decent amount of information as to what we are expecting in Season 4. So I'm briefly going to go over what we've talked about previously in terms of the skins. Pretty much, there is a very reliable source telling us that Thor and Galactus are going to be fighting each other at the end of the Season 3 live event. And once Season 4 is released, this insider source is pretty much saying that Galactus is going to be the secret battle pass skin that we unlock 
in the season four battle pass now of course take this with a grain of salt because nothing is 100 confirmed this is not found in the files but something that was found in the files and confirmed by epic games themselves over on their twitter that some of you guys might have already seen by now is the fact that in november which is going to be at the end of season four we are going to be getting a brand new skin bundle that has a ton of different rewards and brand new skins which are really really cool one of the skins we've been asking for for so long here in fortnite and it's finally confirmed and going to be coming hypex over on twitter said that the upcoming pack for november is going to come with 1000 v bucks it's going to come with three different skins the joker skin the poison ivy skin and also a midas rex which is like a robotic version of midas it's also going to be coming with the laugh riot the back bloom and the midas crest back blings and it will also have three different pickaxes and a contrail that comes and matches with the joker skin outfit set which is really really cool and of course i'll throw the images up on the screen of what the pack is going to look like this is what they're going to use as like promotional images and this is also what it's going to look like when it is featured over in the store and it's finally available for us to purchase and i don't know about you guys but like i said earlier a lot of us have been wanting a joker skin especially because recently they literally just brought back all the batman and the harley quinn skins and the joker is a part of the same universe in dc as batman and harley quinn which makes a lot of sense and on top of that we also have a poison ivy skin and then also a robot version of midas which is pretty interesting considering midas actually plays a very important role in the storyline now although this was confirmed and it's very good news unfortunately they confirmed that this pack is not going to be coming out into fortnite until november 17th which is a little bit of ways from the time i'm making this video and we also do know at this point that the pack is going to cost a total of 30 dollars but when you really think about it now although 30 dollars might be a little bit steep to some of you guys the one thing that is really, really cool about this is the fact that it comes with a thousand V bucks, which has the equivalent of about ten dollars. Bro, the cars are so loud. He's cracked. He's cracked. Get him, boys. Get him. Nice. Let's go. But when you really think about how much awesome stuff is in this pack, thirty dollars is actually a really good price. Like, if you had to buy all of these skins and outfits in the item shop individually, you would be spending way over $30 so overall it's a really good deal although it might be a little bit steep and it's going to feature a lot of awesome skins we've never seen before but wanted for a while here in Fortnite and another brand new piece of information that just came out earlier this morning that is also coming from Hypex which if you guys don't know who that is he is a very reliable source he is a data miner or leaker with over a million followers on Twitter and he's probably one of the biggest sources of information and leaks just because he's always really reliable and very concise on what he gives us in terms of information but over on Twitter he tweeted out saying possible leak epic were planning to make a wolverine skin and a wolverine claws pickaxe that might be released in season four as the secret skin or it's just going to be coming out into the item shop and then in quotes he put this is from a very trusted source and of course if you guys don't know who wolverine is he is another superhero a part of the universe that all of the other superheroes we've seen in the past that fortnite has done collaborations with so it's really no surprise that wolverine's going to be coming into fortnite as well hey, buddy Oh, yo, my teammate just destroyed that guy. Let's, bro, my teammate cheating or what? He just, he literally just hit two for two on those guys. There, dude, oh my God. My team was popping those guys with the snipers. Let's go. So obviously it's not really confirmed if Wolverine is going to be coming or not or how he's going to be introduced or implemented into the game. But the one thing that is cool is there is already some skin concepts that artists have made in the Fortnite community that kind of give us a pretty good idea of what Wolverine would look like if he made his way into Fortnite, which I thought was really, really cool. Oh, well, there was another squad. Wow. But let me know your guys' thoughts and feedback down below. Are, do you think it's a good idea for Fortnite to release a Wolverine skin? I feel like the one problem I have with a lot of the information and leaks that we have about season four is from the sounds of it it just sounds like it's going to be one massive collaboration and instead of fortnite having its own standalone storyline that we all know and love i feel like it's kind of getting lost with these collaborations and all of these different marvel and dc skins are going to make their way into the fortnite universe and kind of alter the storyline which personally i'm not a massive fan of obviously nothing is confirmed and we'll have to wait and see until season four is officially released to see if all of this is going to be coming true but like i said i'm a little bit worried there's a lot of collaborations and a lot of just like superhero Hero skins that are that are planned for season four and i really am not sure how i feel about it because one of the things i love about fortnite is its unique storyline that's going on in the background with all the easter eggs and if they merge that with all the collaborations and things they're doing with other companies it's going to lose that fortnite touch and charm and i don't know 
But I'd love to see what you guys have to say about that down in the comments as well. I know that was a common complaint I was seeing over on Twitter, so I'd love to see what you guys have to say about it as well down in the comments. Come back. Oh my god, I just hit him right in the head. Alright, I kind of caught that guy off surprise. Let's go. That was a sneaky play. And now, oh yo, I think it's a 3v1. I think... Alright, I don't want to get too... Oh, there he is, there he is. Oh my god, I just aimbotted him. I literally just triple headshot him. Let's go, boys. It feels good to finally win a game again. Jeez, how many... Wait, how many elims did we end it off with? 16, that's actually pretty solid. Let's go. The losing streak is finally come to an end. Now, one other thing I did want to mention in terms of the skins that we could be expecting in the Battle Pass and just released throughout Season 4 is the possibility of a Thor skin being in the Battle Pass as well, mainly because we've been talking about the Season 3 live event that's going to be happening here in these upcoming weeks where Thor is going to be fighting Galactus and all this information was found in the files. And one of the leaks that people have been talking about is Galactus being the secret battle pass skin for Season 4, but nowhere have we seen anyone talk about Thor coming into the game as a skin that we could use, which doesn't really make sense considering he's going to be a part of the, the live event. Uh, most of the skins that they do collaborations with are turn out really, really awesome, and I really wouldn't be too upset if we did see like a Thor skin or a Wolverine outfit or something of those sorts come out in the Battle Pass next season. There we go. I got you, teammate. I got you. Don't worry. Let's go, buddy. Oh, and this guy had all the... Wow, this guy had all the loot. Let's go. Oh my god, that was actually so sick. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> I timed that perfectly. Wow, man. Wow, I just obl I just literally obliterated him. Bro, that guy's so weak. Let's, oh my gosh, man. The Impulse Launcher and Kid Shotgun together is such a fun combo. Let's go. They didn't even know where I was when I went over above them. Love to see it. How many we end off with? 16 again. Dang, 16 and 16 back-to-back -back wins. I'll definitely take that. All right, well, that is all I got for you guys in today's video. Like always, let me know your thoughts and feedback down in the comment section below based on all the information that we talked about. Which skin are you excited for? And also, what other skins do you think that Fortnite's going to be adding in Season 4 for Fortnite Season 4's Battle Pass and just overall theme. That's all I got for you guys today. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you are brand new, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, my friends.